Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover with, of course, Dune Hammer Gaming. Say hello, Dune. Hello. And we are just going to continue on into the game. It's only 1947, it's just been a few years. And I am, by the end of this video, going to be at war with the Union of Britain and blowing up a lot of ships, either mine or the enemies. Hopefully, though, more of the enemies in my own. But right yeah. now, let's go ahead and throw in some more subbies and take a quick look at my yeah. spare fleet. I have eight battleships, okay, and 17 light cruisers. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm making it. Oh, this is going to be a huge well, I, task force. I, I'm currently setting up troops on all of the allies that are in Asia. Nice. So it's so nice to have uh, the Republic of Malaya under our control as well. All that rubber and oil and tungsten. <laughs> Actually, even more. We don't need it, but even more. I got a ton of. Sp I got seven spare battleships. Oh, oh, we got a carrier too now. Awesome. But um, actually, all I need is really just chromium. <laughs> it's a shame we just don't have Cuba. Yeah, actually, let's see. Let's take a quick look at uh, not supply, but resources. Because I own Africa. Let's see. I got all. S I got a little bit of rubber. A little bit of tungsten. Oh wait. What about? Oh, they've got some. Because they're oh, actually, allies. Actually, so... I need a little bit more rubber, so let's build up some synthetic refineries. That should be good enough, since I'm building more planes. What do I want to research? I want to research escort carriers. Thank you very much. Improve rocket engines. Sure. Let's get advanced rocket engines. Planes, rocket interceptors, twos. Mm. Don't want to invade Korea, since they have so many divisions. Press censorship. Of course, I love suppressing this, the people. Ah, yes, the press. Suppress. Oh, I can lower the autonomy of. Oh, I can annex the German East Indies. Oh. Should I do that? You could. I am there to protect Actually, it right now. Actually, if I do, I get all the rubber. Holy cow, that's 450 <laughs> rubber. No, that's over 700 rubber. Holy, Holy balls. He said balls, I'm doing it. <laughs> uh, okay, right, well, I, I shall protect it. 46 divisions with... That's giving me 500,000 more manpower. Very nice, thank you. Because somehow, I'm always seemingly... Oh, I'm going to war Sophia, nice. Always out of those... That little manpower. Oh, speaking of manpower, Mongolia's on scraping the barrel and has two divisions. Scraping that Mongolian barrel. Oh, did you garrison some of the islands that you took from Japan that are in the Pacific, perhaps? Oh, I have not. I'm just going to let them die, I think. <laughs> I'll get them back once they die, so... Um, I'm going to go to war immediately with these guys. My divisions actually aren't ready since I did increase my division amounts, I guess. More battalions. Yeah. The Greeks, of course, though, they're very on the offensive. Uh, so, yeah, let me get deploy a strategic Man, bomber. wanting here. that land. Actually. I kind of feel sorry for Mongolia. They have two divisions and I've surrounded them with like a hundred. That's got to be terrifying. <laughs> the Republic of China has got their troops on the border as well. Oh, I'm so sorry, Mongolia. We used to be friends. We used to be friends. But you... You changed. You changed. You changed. You changed. Sophia... You've changed too. Eleven divisions. You've changed as well. I really, I really shouldn't use too many nukes, just because uh, I need to save them for the Union of Britain. I think Dune's grandparents, if I nuke them, they might become slightly irradiated. Uh, just slightly. Just, huh? That didn't kill enough divisions, or kill, hurt their manpower enough. But I think they actually did, decided to put an air force up. Cool. All right, guys, let's go ahead. Let's see what happens. We might not win immediately. That's okay. Manpower check. They're at a quarter million. Which is actually more than me right now. Higher Soviet designer? What's that do? Oh, it gives them armored research. Okay. Actually, we should have air superiority since, yeah, I'm. I've deployed all my forces. They've deployed a couple of their guys. Communist China could uh, do give Falkenhausen citizenship right now. That'd be interesting, seeing Falkenhausen. I a fascist German I... general. Rescinded that. We had poor Sino German relations, even though I did befriend them. I'm... Well, it's there, they can take it. It's ready to be taken on the tree. 
Then you hmm. can do it. Okay, well. I guess that was the Nationalist Chinese, really. Uh, heavy anti battleships. Did I make a super heavy battleship? Did I not? Um, no. I'm saving that for another playthrough of Germany. Which actually, yeah. Actually, resources. Bulgaria, you really don't have that much. That's a little disappointing. Instead of suppressing okay. subjects. Ooh, let's do an Ostval. Actually, that'll come in handy. Despite our gains in the east, we ensure that if the tide turns, we can hold off the enemy advance. Just in case the Soviets might attack, even though they're our allies. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'll be attacking. You don't have to worry. I know, but the Ostval, it gives you plus 20% to land for construction speed, oh, which will damn. come in handy when I go to war with the allies and invade and yeah. get pushed out and start yelling at the screen. Come on, Mongolia. Just die. <laughs> they have 18,000 man, but we're active. Nice. Wow. Oh, uh, Mongolia looks so sad. Oh, I, th I thought Mongolia capitulated. I was like, why can't I take any other land? You know what? I said, like, Dune kind of recommended. I'll give him, give the Greeks Thrace. I'll give him Macedonia so we can end that dispute. Uh, should I give him the rest of Bulgaria or should I annex it? What do you think, Dune? Um, I think you should annex it. It might look a little bit weird with Greece having it. There you go, Greece. You're a little bigger. Yeah, um, do you know what? That looks good. They are a puppet after all. They can just have that bit. Yeah, I can't give him Constantinople, but... Okay, there you go. Nice. Shall I... I'm, I might just take this. Actually, no. No, let's give it to China. Let's give it to China. Oh, that's going to be one thick China. It's going to be one very thick China. But it's not complete. I mean, if you ever played Victoria 2, you know that China should ultimately have... Uh, <coughs> Vladivostok and Karabarovsk. Oh, well, they ain't getting that land. <laughs> because I have no way of giving it to them unless I let them kill Uh... I didn't know that before I played Victoria 2 that, you know, they had <coughs> territory. They had Vladivostok, huh? Yeah. That's interesting. It was in the 19th century that Russia was like, nope. It's mine now. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. Um, actually, you guys have full right. access to this area. To the Adriatic. To this area. Over here, I'm going to say no just for now. Ah. Uh, pimp my no, right. Watching out divisions for really going ham on the, the allies. So how much of a navy do you have? Well, me? Yeah. Um, I'm sitting with like, what will it be like? It's 316 strong, but it is literally all submarines. Okay, just I don't know if you wanted to send any ships to the Union of Britain at one point or another. I don't know if you wanted to. Send them. Actually, I'm going to need some over here for doing naval invasions. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's totally fine. I've got... How many ships do I have here? Uh, let's see. Oh, the Aussies. 195 <laughs> subs. <coughs> um, two carriers, 19 battleships, two heavy cruisers, and 96 light cruisers. And then the starter navy, which isn't very good. Actually, you know what? I might send them. They're in the... Oh, uh, yeah. The Australians are in the... Allies. You know, would it be possible... To take out Australia? Well, I've already got divisions that are going to be ready to go for them, so... I'm going to be doing convoy escorts down here just in case. Which means they're going to need a few planes to cover the area. Um, so will we have, like, divisions, like, or in place to take out Australia? Yeah, I'm already setting up a... Cool. Just because I can go pretty much whenever, well, until October 9th. So I might, let's go ahead and read Justify just in case. I don't know how long that's going to take. 125 days. Ooh, 1944 carrier. Ah, there goes Tibet. Yep, it's the last bit. Well, no, it's oh, not the last wow. bit. Oh, wow. I have not a lot of manpower. I have 720. Ah, oh, service by requirement then. <gasps> Tibet's pushed into India. How dare you? <laughs> Don't know why you've done that, because El Hassa is currently undefended. Your capital. Well done. Smart. <laughs> Just rightful Chinese territory. I <laughs> like you. Good show by that man. Um, carrier fighters, heavy fighters, but 200. Oh, I don't have that. Oh, that's right. That's how come that happened. Yeah, I'm, I keep deploying more and more planes. I have no manpower. Oh, sugar. Best oh, not to go to war until I have that. Red Pink! 
There you go, China. Have a little bit of Tibet. What's a Tibet? <laughs> I've never heard China of that. Now. There is no Tibet. They're just missing the south of China, and then communist China will be sorted. Nice. Uh, how much longer, please? Right, um, I need to wait oof. 42 days for the naval invasion to finish. The common Fairing. turn. World tension increases by one. By one. You get a war go against one. Iraq, huh? Ultimatum to Greece. War yeah, I'm not, don't worry, I won't do that. A war with Germany. Uh, I could do war with Germany. Yeah, I'm you'd just probably... happy to be doing southern thrust so I can take out Iraq. Yeah, you'd probably crush me if we went to war since you got at least eight million more manpower than me. Yeah, plus plus the rest in China as well. Oh wait, I've got divisions around Somalia. Um, well, I, I don't think we need to go to war with Somalia right now, guys. Let's let's go somewhere else. If anything, uh, I don't want us to cause too much supply issues if the Union Britain starts raiding my supply. Come over here, guys. Oh, my mountaineers are only 20 combat with still. What did that even do, the common turn? Because it doesn't... Oh, yeah, France gets influence in Union Britain. Kind of pointless, because A one doesn't exist and one's already communist. Yeah. Watch out, they're turning us more communist. Watch out. Oh, no. Oh, I need a... Gosh, they have divisions in Bangladesh. Okay, Union Britain. All right, okay. And in Burma. I thought All you right, were okay. ending col colonization, Union of Britain. Jeez. Yeah, no, like, there's still wall over here. I've been criticized for weak foreign policy. What do you mean? We took out Bulgaria just now. <laughs> How much war do you want? There go. Slightly behind. I don't think we'll need the naval invasions of Korea, but they're there. Just in case. Yeah, to be honest, I'm probably good to go to war in... In, like, 20 days. Um, I'm re-justifying on them just because the justification already expired, but, uh... Okay, okay, no, I'll be I'll be completely ready then. I mean, all the naval invasions will be ready. Be um, easy. do you have any divisions next to us? Oh, you do. Good. Actually, I should. Oh yeah, don't worry. Course. I have I have divisions everywhere over here. Let's get this carrier group. I'll throw you over here. Now they have two, two battleships and a carrier to help out. So that's actually really good. Um, let me help supply around here. It's not very good. I'm gonna go ahead and get the last meg. It's a little bit ahead of time, but stuff it. Um, should I start justifying on China? Uh, sure, that's, that'd probably be fine, yeah. I'm starting to put yeah, a lot more um, ports in West Pap Papua. Oh, um, yes. Thank you. And you probably could use more ports right there. They don't actually have that many divisions. You only say 16 and 20. So. Oh, field. I finally researched field hospitals. That might have been useful a while ago. Yeah, it's still useful. Slightly. I mean, Germany, manpower issues, things go hand in hand sometimes. I should really send divisions over the Iraq since I've got some thrust. Just like a wee detour. We're going to be able to get back in time for the the war with the Allies. Answers. I probably have enough modern tanks to do this. I'll probably got enough to actually go ahead and upgrade the last lot. I still have a spare. Or, oh, maybe not. The time hasn't really gone on too much. So do that. Uh, can, you can use my air bases, right? Um, we're, I we're don't know. I should be able to. Yeah, yeah I should be able to. I how my nine medium, uh, not medium tanks. How my nine modern tanks shot? God. Oh well, I'm changing. I'm changing. There's only nine. God dang, that's a thick China. God. It's so beautiful. Yeah. Well, it doesn't really need Korea, but... Well, it, it needs Korea. Korea. It needs Korea and the rest of China mm -hmm. and Qingdao, but they're not getting Qingdao, man. No way. No way. It's no, no. Fine. I already returned that to you. I gave it to you. I've got in Hong Kong or Macau as well, or um, Yang's... the other one. That's just taking yeah. important cities, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's... I didn't know about that. The French... Chinese held... The Chinese French held territory, the Guangzhou Wan. I never knew yeah, about that. I, I'm not great at pronouncing it. I'm sure. Oh, I think I got crucified. Wait, it's like, well, sorry, I'm not Chinese. You're... Yeah, <laughs> I don't know that much about Chinese history, except that they're usually on fire. <laughs> uh, 
gave me that construction. I'm literally process. turning you nan into like just a massive fortification. Beautiful. Holy cow! I don't have enough nuclear reactors now. Uh, my goal is a hundred. A oh. hundred nuclear reactors. A hundred. That's my goal. Because right now How many I. Got now? Uh, fifty-eight. Oh damn. I make a nuclear bomb in about one a week. Well. Just one a week, oh. you know. Just, just one. It's like no, nothing to worry about there. Just, just one. Um, I'm running out of territory to build stuff in Europe, though. At least proper Europe, you know, like Germany and all that. Yeah. I've been building so many nuclear reactors. I haven't had time to build up infrastructure. What is wrong with me? That's what I do every game. If I run out of things to build. Just throw on those bad boys. All right, let's oh, see. I need, to, I need to start saving political power for an and you know. Oh yeah, I still get 2.28 a day. That's pretty good. Oh sorry, integrated. I mean, I still have, I have two silent workhorses still. Do I need two silent workhorses? Probably not. But no, maybe not at that stage. Um. But then again, I don't really have anyone I really want to replace it with. Army experience gain. Don't really need that either. Naval XP gain wouldn't be bad. Nuclear research speed. Where is nuclear and stuff being built? Words are hard, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, come on, sir. Thrust finish. I just want to kill a rack. You and everyone else. I uh, just got my 18 tank divisions waiting just to drive on in the Baghdad. Gotta get some of that oil. The, the sandy oil. Even more oil. How much oil do they have? They have 77 oil. Uh, what's your daily gain? My daily gain's 29k. How do I produce more oil than you? Probably because, I don't know. I have almost 42,000, you know, 42k. Oh. Oh, God, I mean, I built I quite know. a few. I mean, Poland is pretty much a nuclear and oil refinery place, but. Ah, uh, actually, I've not, I've not really been building refineries. I only built some just because I needed more rubber. Oh, oh. Ah, right, yes. Yeah, rubber that you don't need now. Yeah, I got over 750, so. Uh, it's a little bit of rubber. Come on, focus. Avoid us. some of these Australian places. How much longer until we can go to war with the good old commies over here? The wrong commies. Yes, the wrong ones. Socialism the... with British characteristics. Uh, shocking. I remember I did that a campaign well, like a year ago, maybe. Maybe when um, Man the Guns came out, I think. Oh, gosh. That is a while now. Yeah, it's been a while. I think I even put the labor, one of the labor images like on, on the thumbnail. It's kind of cool. Oh great! <laughs> Good old labor. No one likes. I think them. it was labor. I might have been the Communist Party. I can't remember. I'm Just saying nobody likes them, but what? Oh, who knows? Let's see. So you are justifying on China. China. Yeah, it's it's still quite far away that justification. Just in case the war with the Allies. Yeah, them. that's okay. Three principles of the people. They still have moderate inflation, ineffective bureaucracy, incompetent officers. And long-term economic planning. Oh, there goes that. Iraq. Goodbye, Iraq. Ah. I could send it off me to Greece, but I I don't think I want to. You should take out Kuwait, just because. Just because, yeah. Could do that. It's not like they have a division. No, do they have anything? They have eight military factories. What? Eight more factories that should be under you. Yes. Right, come on, take back that. That'll finish the war off already. Ah, oh. glorious. There we go. Thank you, Iraq. Oh no, I don't want to pop it yet. I want to take you, <laughs> take you all. Ta da! Nice. Right, those divisions need to return to Burma now. Who do I have? What? Oh, I have a lot of other planes here too. Heavy fighters, heavy fighters. Oh, um, let's come to Europe, guys. We're gonna bomb the hell out of Scotland. Actually, I think I still have emphasis on bombing someone somewhere here. No, maybe I don't. Scotland's gonna have to be bombed out. Smithereens, though. Sad times for Scotland. 
Uh, let's see. I, I need more planes to really do air superiority over that group. That's okay. How many planes does the Union Britain have? I could use strategic bombers to destroy their air bases. They've got about 49,000. Maybe. Hmm. If I have to plan an invasion of southern England, so be it. That's okay. I could probably take Cornwall. Yeah, Cornwall's in the south west, right? Yeah. Yeah. Geography. Good old geography. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna take you and I'm gonna take you and then you. Wait, come on. I made another port here just in case. If needed, I might be able to land there. No, not far away now. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, where's my fleet? Uh, they're kind of hanging out. Oh, uh, there they are. There they are. They're there on naval the extra. Oh no, we're gonna have to cut you in half, I think. No, no, we're covered now. Good, 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 good. good. Excellent. Naval invasions are ready to go. Oh, except for the one in the Sea of Japan. <laughs> Vessor M's carrier group. Make one of you guys. Uh, was I making another carrier? Or am I blind? I might be blind. Oh, yeah, there it is. Carrier group. 1944 battleships. You know, I don't want your pesh divisions, because you can keep them. Just beautiful. Oh, heavy battery fours, yes, please. Double up on those bad boys, 1944, heavy ship full A. Alright. And I shall go to war soon. Vesser M's. Go do that. Well, I am good to go when you are. Cool. Let me get my some more research. I'm trying to finish up my naval doctrine. It's almost done. <coughs> Beard Hospital 2s. Let's get some recon. And let's... Uh, can you go to, to 3 speed, perhaps? Yep. Cool. Let's call in all our allies. Alright, ships. Good luck. Godspeed. Good luck to my minions. And instantly, there's... There's naval stuff all over the place. What the heck? And oh, there we go. People are. No one has joined in yet except from Burma. Thank you for finally joining. They're navally in. invading me. Holy cow! Uh, there's South Africa. All in the other lots. Oh, they are getting absolutely dominated in the air over here by my planes. Nice. Oh yes, Malta. Oh, actually, cannot you know forget what. Yeah. They're actually um, navally invading me, holy cow. They actually navally invaded me, nice. Let's okay. go ahead and send have, all my divisions wow, to the Wow, they have ports. no supply though. Well, they finally called it. So we are... We are actually... Oh my god. Oh, uh, can we maybe lower by one speed? I want to see what's going on in the naval <laughs> theater. <laughs> holy cow. Have you seen it over here? Do you see all the, uh, little, uh, oh maybe you don't days. see it. Just, oh my. I lost 70 planes in exchange for 24 destroyers. Did I lose any ships? Because there's way too many, um, things for me to look at right now. Holy cow. Oh gosh, even the game's struggling slightly. We've got some lag. Did I lose anything? I'm, I'm sure I've lost something. I've killed... Uh, duh. Duh. I've killed over, we've killed over a million? I've killed over a million already. What? I've killed, <laughs> holy cow. <coughs> well, it's a shame, you know, Australia's not joined in yet. Oh, they will, I'm sure they will. I've, I'm blowing up all their ships, holy crap, oh my god. Wait. All these carriers, all these battleships. Oh, the Republic of Malaya decided to leave the Allies. Oh, that sucks. 15 destroyers. Oh, I'm gonna invade them. It's set up for no One way or another, <laughs> you're gonna get invaded. And you're gonna like it. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna die. I want all the resources from you. Holy cow. What's going on here? I lost a sub in exchange for some more, some more ships. That's fine. Oh, what's going on up here? 
Oh, same thing. I'm losing more subs, but that's okay. Subs are expendable. It's mostly convoys. No. Oh, bollocks. I forgot about, forgot about my naval invasion in uh, Korea. <laughs> oh, yeah. I sunk the pride of the fleet. Two battle cruisers, 17 destroyers, three light cruisers, two heavy cruisers in exchange for a couple planes. I sunk the next pride of the fleet in a battleship. Another two. Oh, my God. How many ships have been killed? They're trying Sounds to like, navally oh, invade me, but I put my entire main army on the coast. Yeah, it feels like they've had a lack of judgment there. I mean, they've been preparing for the last 12 years, but, um, yeah. I'll take more panzers if, thank you very much. Uh, I feel like the Union has just abandoned Bangladesh. They were over. Well, I've killed they... probably at least 200 ships. Let's see. Let's take a quick look. How many ships have I killed so far? All or nothing? I have killed a... Uh, let's see, can we go by current month? I've killed 836 ships. Holy crap. Most of them, of course, are convoys, but... Uh, Still count. <laughs> over 800. Now, can I do a naval invasion of Scotland? Uh, can you pause it real quick? Yep. And then we'll end that so because I know you have to go. Uh, I... Dude. And uh, before I launch the naval invasion, I'm going to ruin all the supply in Scotland. Which I know is a bad idea. But this is just German things. I'm going to... You'll see. It's going to take me a little, just a little bit of time. Um, I want to apologize ahead of time for your grandparents. So... I was... <laughs> it's fine. Like literally, Scotland's going to be fallout. Every tile. Oh, it's okay. It'll take time to repair, but it'll be back, and we'll be stronger than ever. Uh, almost done. <clears throat> Nuke that airbase. Oh, a couple divisions there. Scapa flow. Gosh, I've lost more men than you have right now. <laughs> All right, you can unpause it. All right. Give it a few days, maybe a week, max. Oh, Bangladesh is um, guys, left. I can't see Scotland anymore. I think it's in the water. <laughs> um, try that, guys. Try that. See what happens. That is so much smoke coming out of Scotland. Jesus Christ. I cannot see. I'm quite disappointed. Is this the, in, like, the Industrial Revolution happening again? Like, There's so much smog up here. Oh, <laughs> now I can see it again. Okay, good. <coughs> well, that only killed a quarter million soldiers, but we'll see what happens with 40 combat with tank divisions moving in. We'll see what happens. Oh! Uh, sadly, no we should <coughs> end there. I don't yeah. know if that's a big cliffhanger. Uh, yeah, you can go pause it. That's a big cliffhanger, but that'll be fun for tomorrow. That was good. Well, oh. I've kind of mopped up over here. It's Wait. a shame the Aussies aren't wanting to join in, the pussies. Yeah. Did I start this or did you start this? <coughs> Yeah, you did. Oh, cool. So I guess we'll end it here then. Um, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, as you just saw, um, Scotland probably realistically wouldn't exist anymore, but you know what toy for, but that's okay. We've done really well. Dune has been taking out Asia, and I've been having a good time with preparation. So if you enjoyed the episode, guys, leave a like. Um, if you haven't subbed to either one of us, maybe consider subbing to one of us. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed the episode, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks for watching.